Okay, so let's talk yellowtail. Okay, yellowtail. Let's talk fishing yellowtail. Mm -hmm. Fishing yellowtail is fantastic. Obviously, we're in Southern California, and seasonally, the yellowtail come up. They're my favorite jack. In fact, the only jack that I'll eat. And they're my favorite fish. Why do you call it jack? It's a jack. That's the type of fish that it is. It's not a tuna. A lot of people think that yellowtail is a tuna, but it's yellow it. fin. And this is yellowtail, which is a jack. It has nice, light-colored uh, meat. OK. Not fishy, really good texture. They call it hamachi in a, yes. uh, in a Japanese yes. restaurant. Yes. But it is like, you know, like the king of the fish meat. It's really, really good. Not fatty? Not fatty at all. Very Just lean, very lean. Very lean. OK. Yeah. And um, readily available in most places. You can find, they call it either yellowtail or hamachi. OK. That's what it is. That's what we and look for. you want to get the good stuff. This I actually caught myself, so. Well, then that's a good stuff. This is Excellent. Good stuff. Yeah, yeah, right. Um, so what I like to do for this recipe, which is just a tostada, really simple Mexican-inspired recipe. That's great. Is you take the loin and split it this way. And we'll use this for other bits, but this is the part we want. So you cut mm. with the grain on that, but now you're cutting against the grain. Now you cut against the okay. grain, yeah. So the first one's going to be kind of a sacrificial piece to go into a poke bowl. OK. <laughs> but then you slice these, and this is what you want. This is a leche de tigre, which is essentially just vegetable oil, salt, and aji amarillo pepper. And so the sequence is you take a little of this leche de tigre okay. and you just put it on the tostada. And these you can either fry yourself or just get at the store. Then you take a little bit of yellowtail and you put it on each one. You don't need much. You know, too much and it's a different dish. It, it, it's too fit. I, I don't want to say it's fishy because yellowtail isn't fishy, but it's but just too... A, um... There's a texture to it. Yeah. I mean, you want a little of this fish, but not a lot. The whole idea with the tostada is that it's the flavor combo and the texture. There's the crunch of the uh -huh. tortilla. There's the mush of the fish. It. There's yeah. like the, the kind of like, you know, I don't even know what you call it, sauciness of the, of the leche de tigre. And then all the other nice ingredients. You say sauciness, here. I say yumminess. yumminess. And I say leave them wanting more. Exactly. Leave them <laughs> That's wanting what more. we're doing. Exactly. This yeah. is a happy hour item. Exactly. Then you take a little bit of fresh lime juice okay. and just squeeze it on the fish. That's what you want to hit. So in essence, though, the lime juice is cooking the fish. It's cooking the fish. Right? So and it just balances it out nicely. Yeah. Then I take a little bit of this mustard seed. This is just white and black mustard seed mixed. Nathan and likes mustard. I do. And yeah. then I sprinkle it on there just a little bit. This is another textural element that has some good flavor. OK. So you get these little pops of mustard as you're eating it, which is really great. And this is just a little Fresno chili from our farm. It's like spicy, but you don't want too much of it. So, you know, just a little bit is enough. And okay. that, that gives you a little spice. And then you take a little bit of cilantro, put it on there. Now, is this like a, a hit at the restaurant? Is this like a number this is one? A, yeah, this is, a, this is a, and it's on the happy hour menu, and it's yeah. probably the single most common thing that I sell. Okay. okay. And then the final thing is always just a little bit of finishing salt, not much. And just, you know, you just want an accent. Oh, I think that looks great. Thank you. I, That's it, it's super easy. And you can put these together, like it's, it's, you know, if you train your guests, you can have just the bar set up with all the things and then they prepare these little tostados themselves or serve it plated. You're going to serve it plated, but I'm going to eat it. Let's taste it. Let's, let's do it. Okay. Yeah, let's totally do it. <laughs> I love the crunch. Yeah. I love it all. It's yeah. delicious. It's fun. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of fun. To me, this says summer. Oh, it's great. 